Hi, welcome back. Today, I'd like to spend some time and give you a quick overview about this course. In this course, the ultimate goal is to help you better prepare your next SQL interview as a data analytics professional. And I'll teach you the tips and tricks that will really help you become much more familiarized with the SQL interview process. You will also learn how to develop a very good coding style for writing a SQL query. Believe me, it will leave a very good impression to the interviewer if you have a good coding style. This course is also laser focused on the most important SQL operations and concepts, and it will save you time so you can focus on things that truly matter. After all, to really master and become so good at a SQL interview, you have to run a lot of SQL coding exercises. Fortunately for this course, you'll have plenty of opportunities to practice your SQL coding skills in an online playground. The first section will be focusing on mostly single table based operations such as select, where conditions, order by, limit, and then we're gonna go to some aggregated functions such as group by, having, etc. And then in the end of the first section, we're gonna spend some time to look at some relatively more advanced operations such as like for partial regular expression and case one for more advanced data transformation. The second section is about joining multiple tables. And we're gonna mostly spend time on inner join and left join, and then briefly touch base on union and union all. The third section, I have prepared a very special set of uh, functions. Usually they're commonly referred to as window functions. Those are the functions that are critical for doing analytics data preparations. Finding the median, finding the top among different groups, those kind of thing. And in each section, there are several different components. At the very beginning of each section, we will go through several different lectures and to cover the concepts of uh, some certain important SQL operations, followed immediately by a list of exercises where you will spend your time practicing on an online coding environment. After that, I will show you step by step how I will tackle these same uh, questions so you can learn from me. In the end of each section, there are a list of more exercises to help you better prepare for the real interview. And you'll be practicing real interview questions at the end of each section. Let's talk about where you will be practicing SQL. For this course, I have created an online playground called SQLpad.io. You will be able to practice a list of curated interview questions that are collected over the internet. Here's an example of the online query environment. You can go in here, edit your SQL query, and submit your SQL query. And if you got a wrong answer, it, the online judge will tell you that your answer is not correct. And please try again. And if you nailed this question, you will see a success message. And if you are really stuck on one specific problem and you really need some help, you can click on the solution link and then a pop-up window will show up and you will see my own solution. But I highly recommend that you try your best before you look at my solution. And we will repeat the same processes again and again until the end of this course. By the time you finish this course, you will have completed about 100 exercises and you will become a master of those critical SQL operations. Look forward to see you in the next section.